What's up guys, Neely here, back with an Android game review. Um, and so while this game is gonna, or while this review is gonna be a Android specific game, um, if you do a search in the Apple um, App Store, I'm sure you'll find similar versions of the game. So I recently finished watch, or listening to the audiobook for Ready Player One, and um, I couldn't quite remember the game Joust that was played by um, Wade Watts to to get the first key. So I browsed around and I vaguely remember it, but I figured I want to play the game to get a full recollection of it, the game itself. So I went into the Google Play Store, did a search for Joust, and I found a game called Jouster, as you see here. Um, so the game itself on um, Android, as far as the settings goes, are very straightforward. You can set the difficulty level. You can select how you um, play the game, and that's pretty much it. And then you have two game modes, survival or free-for-all. Um, it's supposed to be a pretty um, good comparison to, or, um, yeah, basically, I guess a pretty good comparison to the original game. Um, as far as you have your standard ostrich mounts and you're a knight with a jousting stick and you have to joust against your opponents. Um, so with that, I'll jump into the game and it's actually pretty straightforward. If you want a good comparison as far as what the game is all about, it's kind of like Flappy Bird, but, um, rather than having to, um, um, fly through pipes, you have to try and defeat the, um, other, uh, player's mount by stomping on their head. So it's kind of like taking, um, a play from the Super Mario Brothers, um, playbook and, um, trying to jump on as many mushrooms as you can, but rather than, um, Get, uh, jumping on mushrooms, you're trying to disable the other mounts. So, as you can see, if you're um, if you're playing for a while, it might get kind of annoying. The there's uh, multiple levels to, or a couple of different levels to the games. Um, tapping on the right side of your screen will keep your bird afloat. Tapping on the left side of your screen will allow you to uh, change directions. So if you want to go down a little bit, then just uh, remove your um, hand from the screen. And you can see about as far far down as um, the characters go. Um, so that's really the bulk of the game. It's pretty straightforward. So if you want something that's um, pretty, uh, I don't want to say simple or straightforward, but if you want something that's a little bit different, has a retro feel to it, then um, there then Joust can be the way to go. If you're into retro games, then um, Jouster is the way to go. Um, there is a free and paid version. The free version is supposed to um, have ads in it, but which is a version that I'm playing here. I haven't run across ads yet, so I don't know if because the game hasn't been updated for the latest um, Google... Um, um, add platforms and um, operating systems and all of that stuff that that's why it doesn't work but um, the game hasn't been updated for some time so there is that I think it's the last update was either 2015 or 2013 something like that so um, but you can get the paid version 99 cents if you want to support the developer so the paid version so 2013 was the last time it was updated it doesn't ha doesn't really have good reviews either in the Google Play Store um notably because pro I think it was probably reviewed back in the day when it was first um uh, uh back when it was first added to the um Play Store and the other thing actually before I besides the ads that you can get is that you can get different mounts as well so if you want to move from beyond just the aqua marine blue mount you can do that and you can i guess get access to all the different levels that are there so there is that so if you want to um do that there is that i didn't see too many other versions of the game i guess it's too retro or there's no rights to it but um, i was trying to figure out um who owned the rights but i didn't see too much there either um but as far as official the official game i didn't see any uh newer um versions of it if you wanted to play that but i guess if you just want to do a one player version to play the game then um 
Flappy Birds might be the way to go there. So that's really the bulk of the game. Um, I just I just wanted to play the game and see what what, what or review refresh my memory for um, what the game was and see what was it, what if it was all about. See if it was any good. See um, why it would be a game for uh, to be put as a level to or to get a game to beat in Ready Player One. But that's all there is for this particular review. If you want to get in touch with me, you can find me on Twitter at PatelN01. You can find this review and all reviews on YouTube at youtube.com slash PatelN01. And of course, all uh, links, subscription links, all of that good stuff can be found on the website at PatelN01.com. And of course, if you want to help support the show, get content early and all of that good stuff, then visit. be sure to visit the Patreon at patreon.com slash PatelN01. But that's all there is for this review. Thanks for watching and listening, and until next time.